Welcome, dear seekers of wisdom and harmony, to this enlightening discussion on a practice that has intrigued humanity since time immemorial, the practice of semen retention, the practice that has its roots in ancient cultures, religions, and philosophical systems around the globe, connecting us with the timeless wisdom of our ancestors. Before we delve into the details, it's vital to acknowledge the power of the subject at hand. Our sexual energy, an intrinsic part of our existence, is one of the most potent forces known to humanity. This life-giving force, however, is not only about procreation, but is also a key to unlocking untapped spiritual potential and forging a path of self-realization and inner wisdom. At the very heart of human connection, Sexual activity serves not just as a means of procreation or a source of pleasure, but as a profound exchange of energies that can impact the individuals involved on multiple planes, physical, emotional, and spiritual. On the physical plane, the act involves an evident exchange of bodily energies and fluids, along with the tangible exertion of energy. This level, while crucial, is only the surface of the oceanic depths that this interaction can reach. Delve deeper, and you encounter the emotional plane of energy exchange. Here, feelings and emotions ranging from raw lust and passion to deep love and affection are stirred, shared, and absorbed. This energetic interaction can give rise to a bond, a sense of connection that may extend beyond the confines of the physical act and persist over time. Delve even deeper, beyond the realm of the tangible and the conscious, and you encounter the spiritual plane of this energetic exchange. Here, a soul-deep connection can form, transcending the physicality of the act and resonating on a level that echoes through the spiritual dimensions of the individuals involved. This bond, formed through the exchange of spiritual energy, can be potent, often outliving the physical relationship itself. However, it's crucial to acknowledge that the nature of these bonds and the impact of this energy exchange are far from uniform. The strength and quality of these bonds depend significantly on the individuals involved and their emotional and spiritual maturity. A fleeting liaison might not generate a strong bond, while a deep, emotionally rich relationship can lead to a connection that reverberates through time and space. Moreover, the energy transfer during sexual activity can profoundly influence our emotional states, our vitality, and our spiritual growth. It's this realization that has led many spiritual traditions to emphasize the importance of mindful, respectful sexual activity, advocating for a conscious approach to this powerful energetic exchange. Sexual activity is a potent symphony of energy exchange with the potential to etch deep imprints on our physical, emotional, and spiritual beings. It is a dance of shared energies that can create enduring bonds and catalyze profound personal transformation. From the esoteric teachings of Tantra to the physiological sciences of the East, from the doctrines of ancient Tao to the mystical traditions of the Occident, the practice of semen retention or brahmacharya as it's known in the East, has been recognized as a pathway to harness this divine force within us. An inherent component of many spiritual traditions, this practice involves the intentional conservation of seminal energy, turning the tide of outwardly ejaculation to an inward ascension of this potent energy. You may wonder why there's a need to retain semen, a biological substance seemingly designed for external release. This is where the profound wisdom underlying semen retention comes into play. It's posited that each ejaculation carries away with it not just potential life but also a significant part of one's vital energy, depleting one's inner vigor and spiritual potency. The semen thus conserved is believed to be reabsorbed into the body, initiating a process of energy transmutation. This transmutation elevates the raw physical force into a subtle spiritual one, enriching one's pranic energy, enhancing mental acuity, and leading to spiritual awakening. Moreover, in the harmonious dance of yin and yang, the feminine and masculine principles of the cosmos, semen retention is believed to bolster a man's weaker yang nature. By consciously embracing the powerful yin energy that a woman's orgasm manifests, a man strengthens his energy, 
fostering a perfect equilibrium of these cosmic forces within. Accompany me, dear reader, on this divine odyssey as we explore the profound mysteries of semen retention, a practice steeped in layers of wisdom. Remember, as we embark on this pilgrimage, our aim is not the suppression or denial of the potent sexual force that dwells within us. Rather, we seek to transfigure and ascend this energy, raising it from its lower nature. Our exploration will reveal the key to directing this vibrant force, a reservoir of potentiality not solely towards sensual gratification, but towards the attainment of an elevated state of consciousness, a blossoming of spiritual growth. Our journey beckons us towards the ultimate communion with the divine spark residing within us, beckoning us to ascend from our mortal coil and unite with our divine essence. As Neville Goddard professed, the time it takes your assumption to become fact, your desire to be fulfilled, is directly proportionate to the naturalness of your feeling of already being what you want to be, of already having what you desire. So let us assume and feel the fruition of our journey even before we embark, and the path will unfold with grace and ease. So, what is one of the main factors driving us away from reaching higher spiritual growth and reactivating and powering up that spiritual energy that is dwelled into the body? A billion-dollar industry known as pornography, artificial intimacy that is affecting the authentic human being, T is imperative to discuss the implications of excessive consumption of pornography on our spiritual well-being. This practice can serve as a discordant note, creating a disconnection from our higher self, leaving us in a state of void, yearning for a sense of fulfillment that eludes us. This disconnection acts as a veil, clouding our spiritual progression and diverting our attention from the pursuit of loftier, more meaningful experiences. It alters our perception of sexual energy, a sacred force revered across diverse spiritual traditions for its transformative power and its capacity to forge a divine connection. Rather than seeing this potent energy as an expression of love, a means of cultivating intimacy, or a vehicle to transcend the mundane and experience heightened states of consciousness, it is objectified and commodified in the realm of excessive pornography consumption. This reductionist approach sees sexual energy being used merely as an instrument for physical gratification, stripping it of its divine potential. Moreover, the addictive patterns that can accompany such consumption create a relentless cycle of craving and dissatisfaction, a wheel of suffering that impedes our journey towards inner peace and contentment. This vicious cycle can act as a formidable barrier to spiritual enlightenment a state often achieved by fostering qualities like self-discipline, mindfulness, and a deep sense of satisfaction with life. Yet, as we navigate these turbulent waters, it is crucial to remember that these potential spiritual effects are not inescapable. They can be mitigated through a series of practices such as meditation, introspection, and the cultivation of a balanced and respectful approach towards our sexuality. Remember, dear reader, we are not victims of circumstance, but the masters of our destiny, capable of navigating through any storm and reaching the calm waters of spiritual enlightenment. If you do suffer from this grave spiritual weapon that has been forged against you, do not fret, dear child. Be patient. Grant yourself time to give birth to the new you who does not partake in those activities. In the end, you will be forever grateful in deep gratitude for the energy that you was able to retain and transmute into becoming the highest version of yourself.